Bagong gepit ah. Bagong gepit ah. Dito na si Congressman Tepes, ako kayo magaling. Ha? Pinakitin niya na pala. Malakas ang boss mo eh. Umuugong. Pinakitinig. Malakas. Namakas siya. Ilang months ang tabi? Seven. Kaya, kung ano ka. Sino ito ko? Hindi ko siya kaya nataas. Ay, may iwan tayo. <laughs> Ang cute-cute. Buti lang, hindi ka mukha ng tatay. Halika <laughs> na, doon na tayo. So, the order I would like to have the, the families around the font is um, Reno here, and then uh, Pearl, and then Ralph, and then Shvay. Okay? Kind of how the order is going to go. Kind of volunteer. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have to take the candle off the holder and somebody to hold it while I present the candle. Okay. So, is there anybody who would like to help me with that? Okay. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome to walk around the font. You're welcome to take pictures as you already are around the font. I'm not going to get distracted by your children, so don't worry about your children. I will talk a lot of them making cry, okay? It's not going to be a problem. The other thing is um, for the candles, there's, can uh, there's boxes for the candles. So uh, at the end of the baptism, uh, once you've blown out your candles, you can use the boxes to store them. Are we ready? Ready to start? Yes. Okay, let's start. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Dear parents and godparents, oh, okay. Dear parents and godparents, your families have experienced great joy at the birth of your children, and the church shares your happiness. Today, this joy has brought you to the church to give thanks to God for the gift of your child, and to celebrate a new birth in the waters of baptism. This community rejoices with you for today, the number of those baptized in Christ will be increased, and we offer you our support in raising your child in the practice of the faith.
Okay? So keep that in mind after this baptism. The next thing we're going to do is something called prayers of the faithful. And the response of these prayers is, Lord, we ask you, hear our prayer. So if you all could repeat, Lord, we ask you, hear our prayer. Dear brothers and sisters, let us invoke the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ for Rainio, Harold, Ralph, and Faith, who are about to receive the grace of baptism and for their parents, godparents, and all the baptized. From in each of us, Lord, we ask you, hear our prayers. As Catholics, we believe that the saints are very much alive in heaven. And because the saints are in heaven, who better to ask for prayers than the saints themselves? And so right now we're going to invoke the saints' names and we're gonna ask them to pray for us. So. Bless this water right here for the baptism. During the prayers of this blessing, God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I do. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, suffered death, and was buried, rose again from the dead, and is seated at the right hand of the Father? I do. So I'm going to ask a question. The response is, it is, if in fact it is. Okay? So, is it your will, therefore, that Raniel, Pearl, Ralph and faith should receive baptism in the faith of the church, which we have all professed with you. If so, respond, it is. It is. Perfect. All right, let's bring Ramiel over here. So what we're going to do is just kind of lay him. Yeah, there you go. Ramiel. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Very good. You did a wonderful job. All right, let's bring uh, Pearl over here. Before I anoint each one of them, let me do the prayer of the anointing. Almighty God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ has freed you from sin, given you new birth by water and the Holy Spirit, and joined you to his people. He now anoints you with the chrism of salvation, so that you may remain members of Christ, priest, prophet, and king, unto eternal life. Amen. You're 
get all over your head. <laughs> Happy pag titas. Matamoy matanda. Nakating ano pa ba nga ngayon? Godmother works. <clears throat> These candles represent the light of Christ. This candle right here, this is called the Easter candle. And this candle was blessed on Saturday night of Easter. Every year we bless one of these candles. And if you've ever been to the Easter Vigil Mass on Saturday night, one of the things that we do during the Easter Vigil is we bring a fire in from the outside into the church. And that fire represents the light of Christ coming into the church. And this candle represents the light of Christ. And so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be presenting these children the light of Christ. So go ahead one at a time and light your candle and then uh, you can take that over by your child. See the light. See the light of Christ. See the light of Christ. See the light of Lord God Almighty, through His Son, born of the Virgin Mary, He brings joy to these, children, these Christian mothers as the hope of eternal life shines forth upon their children. May He graciously bless these mothers of Reno, Pearl, Ralph, and Faith, so that as she now gives thanks for the gift of her child, she may always remain united with Him in thanksgiving. In Christ Jesus, our Lord. Amen. And now, fathers, if you could get near your child or take your child. If it's, if it's possible. If it's not, it's not a problem. May the Lord God Almighty, the giver of life both in heaven and on earth, bless these fathers of Renyo, Pearl, Ralph, and Faith, so that together with their wives, they may, by word and example, prove to be the first witnesses of the faith to Renyo, Pearl, Ralph, and Faith. In Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. And now. And thank you for attending. It was a beautiful ceremony. I enjoyed being with you this afternoon. Our award ceremony.